If you get an opportunity to do something that is a little bit outside your comfort zone, just do it. Yeah, jump, do it. <laughs> I'm Tracy. I have FSH muscular dystrophy, also known as fascio-scapulohumeral muscular dystrophy. It's a degenerative disease. It's also hereditary. It was passed on through my mum. I'm now 53 years old and, um, yeah, living my life to the fullest. A great day for me is spending time with my friends. We'll just go and have lunch somewhere wherever it takes us when we get hungry and then we come home again. That is my perfect day. Not having to worry about being disabled and just having fun. Another perfect day would be hanging out on the range shooting. I got into shooting purely by accident. I went there on, on the mission to, to shoot a, a pistol. Well, I couldn't even pick the pistol up. And um, I was so, so totally devastated. One of the ladies there said to me, oh, don't, don't stress too much. She said, go down and have a try of the rifle. And I'm thinking, if I can't pick up a pistol, how do I pick up a rifle? Well, the rifle you can put on a stand. And so off I went, they put the rifle in my hand and um, the lady that was there on the day that put that rifle in my hand is now one of my best friends. And her um, advice to me was, couple of deep breaths and when you see it shoot it don't hesitate so that's what I did and it just happened to have the Olympic coach standing behind me when I was doing it and he's raised his eyebrows at her and and um, when I finished shooting he looked at her and he looked at me and he said would you like to maybe take this up as a sport you know and I went yeah I'd love to eight months after that I actually made it on the Australian shooting team. My life changed that day. Seriously, it changed that day. I became Tracy with the gun, hanging out with these really cool people, all disabled people with all different types of disabilities. So I was just one of the crowd. Without the disability, I would not have picked up that rifle, I don't think. And I wouldn't have traveled the world like I've wanted to travel the world. I wouldn't have met the most amazing people, people that inspire me to keep going. Yeah, I, li I live a pretty cool life, I really do.